Hello and welcome. So in this video, I will discuss about explosive meter. And uh, as you all know, it is used to detect combustible gases and vapors. So it is also known as combustible gas detector. And uh, this is uh, the diagram of this explosive meter. And now we will see some important points related to explosive meter. So explosive meter consists of a wheat stone bridge. So this is the wheat stone bridge. It is uh, in balanced condition. So the so no current pass through the galvanometer. Galvanometer series, uh, shows no reading. So for this. Uh, explosive meter to work uh, properly we need at least 10 percent of oxygen for its correct operation so now we will see the working of the galvia this uh, explosive meter so the first point here is gas enters through this uh, chamber using aspirator uh, bulb and a flexible tube so gas enters from here and the gas will goes to the here and flies back arrest and now come, when gas come here it will burn because this is a uh, heated this is a heated filament and uh, the power is given through this battery so this is heated filament and, uh, and the gas burns here and which uh, give rise to temperature and the temperature of this filament rises to rises more and temperature of this filament uh, increases and due to the increase in the temperature of this filament resistance also increases means resistance changes initially the resistance of all the uh, resistors are equal but now the resistance of this uh, this filament changes therefore this is the now become unbalanced and now current will flow through this current will flow through this circuit and uh, you can see the readings in this galvanometer so basically this current is proportional to the amount of gas uh, present in the atmosphere and uh, this uh, galvanometer will show a reading in ppm so this is uh, the basic uh, working principle of uh, explosive meter that uh, we need to know and uh, this much is important from this topic that you need to write in exam so thank you